What's up everybody and welcome to my channel where I do weekly pick a card readings that challenge you to explore all things growth and I am so excited today because I created my own oracle deck and we are going to be doing an unboxing and a review of it today. We're also going to be doing a little bit of a review of Printer Studio. It's the online company that allowed me to create my own oracle deck. They they allow you to customize just about anything. So you just kind of dump your designs in and they will print it on anything. Before we do that, I'm just going to tell you really quick how I was able to make this deck because it was actually very, very, very simple. All I did was take the keywords to my three favorite oracle decks. I call these my Three Horsemen of the Enlightenment. If you've watched one of my picket card readings or you've been a client of mine, then you have definitely seen one of one of these decks. Some keywords of my own and put them together. I will keep them in my life forever and ever. I have a bond with them individually, but together they just give the most accurate and the most in-depth readings. This is the soul's journey. This is the power of surrender, and this is moonology, and if you are new to the spiritual practice or new to div divination, these three right here, especially collectively together or even individually, are great for beginners, for anybody. These decks are amazing. So I kind of was inspired by these three, put them together into a deck. This tapestry here. Um, I have this tapestry hanging above me right now. I use that tapestry for my tuck box. So Printer Studio is very easy. All you do is go online, you upload your images, put them where you want them, hit submit, put in some information. It said it was going to take like two weeks, but I want to say it's only been about eight days since I ordered these, so they came super quick. I love that print out. So I got a glossy, glossy finish on my tuck box. The tuck box doesn't feel super strong, like I feel if I shake it, the cards are gonna come flying out, but that's okay, it came out, the print came out gorgeous. Pretty cute. So the cards, the cards. So we're gonna crack them open. I'm so excited. Oh, I can already tell this cardstock is amazing. Hey, girl. <laughs> This is the bags. Oh, they slide together. Oh, look at that slide. This cardstock is dope. I'm expecting some words to be a little askew and um, some stuff to be because I did just kind of put this together really quick because I was so eager to get it done. But you can expect a lot of colors and a lot of fun. And let's just get to it. We're going to start from the top. So again, I just chose an image that I thought went best with the word, the keyword. And with this one, I'm just trying to take some time. This is a personal deck for myself. Look at the colors. Oh my God, I'm so excited. <laughs> I am so excited to flip through this and use this personally and just show it to my friends. This is so dope. Look at this. I'm going to get my chakras so imbalanced with this. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, I tend to be a little inconsiderate if I'm being honest, which I almost always am with you guys. Um, I tend to be a little uh, inconsiderate. I think about myself, especially now that I'm kind of like, in this hustle man t uh, hustle mode right now, so uh, this is a great card to kind of make sure that I'm thinking about my family and other people. Is this gonna focus, or are you gonna? Thank you, upset me. 
I'm gonna try not to make this video long, so we're gonna do a quick, a quick flip through. You can just get a general idea why I chose which image for which keyword. And if you know anything about colors and their meanings and the the matching of the chakras and why I kind of line them up. But it was easy with the Soul's Journey Oracle deck as well as the um, Surrender Oracle deck and the Moonology, just combining them together. Their keywords are just really in depth. This is for shadow work, shadow work. Reconnecting with your childlike behavior. Oof, I need this card right here. <laughs> yeah, some of my images got cut off on the side. Like I was just, I was in such a hurry. I was so excited when I came up with this idea. So, I wouldn't be surprised if we flipped and one of the words were all over the place. Time is just an illusion, ladies and gentlemen. This cardstock is dope. It just slides. It's nice and, um, what do I want to say? Durable. enough how easy it was to put this together. I used uh, the emoji and Canva. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> in the bathroom. Isn't that when we are at our most confident? And right there in that bathroom, duck facing it. <laughs> goals in order. Deep orange. That deep orange. Fear. Sometimes I have a hard time just accepting that things are just the way that they are. I'm kind of trying to develop a mantra of it is what it is, taking a deep breath and just saying it is what it is. So I needed this card deeply. And this is just me. Every day I try to find a way to um, help and be of service some way. And I've been grateful to um, have had jobs that have allowed me to do that. So there's that. Usually when someone says real talk, they lying. <laughs> yeah, so this is one. I don't know if we've already passed one. Well, we've probably already passed a few, but this is one of the keywords that I kind of threw in myself. Just to kind of remind myself of what I'm surrounded by and what the goal is. This is a perfect card for what we're going through right now. As an intuitive, it's hard to, I don't know, if, is that an oxymoron? As an, as an intuitive, it's hard to trust yourself. Even as an intuitive, it's hard to trust yourself. Um, so I really needed this one to kind of put myself in check that I'm, I'm usually connected with my spirit guide, so I'm usually on the right path. So when I'm kind of sitting and wondering like, what the fuck am I doing? Um, I can kind of trust that I'm, I'm going in the right direction as long as I'm leading with leading myself with my heart space. Transformation, baby. It's all about that growth. I'm all about that growth and transformation. And just continuously reinventing yourself. I love this one. How cute is that? Just kind of not being so serious all the time. 
not that serious. This is a hard one for me. It's easier said than done, if I'm being honest. So yeah, I definitely uh, needed this one. I think this one I threw in. Maybe I didn't. Am I taking, am I taking credit for shit? <laughs> Death, rebirth, after life. We're just going in and coming right back. I put the poop emoji to uh, to solidify that. We're all just going into the ground and coming right back. It's all energy, baby. All death means is just the beginning of something else. Gratitude. This is mine. Oh, my empaths knew. It's hit you right in the heart space. <laughs> sink yourself in. Just gotta surrender. Oh, that word kind of bled together, but you get the gist. That's a vibrant green. Yeah, make it happen, baby. I chose that specifically. The tarot readers know why. That's one of my keywords. Let's see how the words, uh, the words a little askew, it's a little off, <laughs> but it'll do its job. I'm on my way. That's not me though. This is not me. You can ask any one of my friends. I'm always the first one there. I don't be late for shit. I don't like that. Oh, here we are. So, some of you may know from my previous readings that I'm a recovering alcoholic. And, um, I just need this in my life. Just as a reminder. Just as a reminder. Anybody that's an addict knows what this image means. That front you're trying, everything is just a front. You feel like shit, you look like shit. But you're trying to pretend like everything's all good. And I can make anything an addiction. <laughs> As you can see with my Oracle deck collection, I can turn any good thing and make it bad for myself. So I really, like, if this card pops out on me, then that, that means I'm, I'm diving too deep into something and I need to slow down because I can do that with anything, whether it be alcohol or sugar or uh, divination, excuse me, divination or anything. I can make anything. <laughs> I can do the most. I always do the most. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> if you could wrap my personality up in a card, that's it right there. <laughs> I'm going to show this to my husband. He's going to get a kick out of that one. Yep. The most important. This is one of mine. I put this one in here. Kind of the same diff, but not really. But you get it. Mm -hmm. Trust it. Trust it. I love this. Yep. Again, so you gotta mix that card. Where to go? <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. 
mix these two cards together and that's me all the time. <laughs> better <laughs> everything's better after you release that's it that's my deck you guys leave me a comment let me know what you thought oh that glide is so great okay let's do a um shuffle so I'm already going to know, yeah, I can't do that grip. So we're going to have to do a long shuffle. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to do long hand over hand. Oh, that's great. That card stock. I'm in love with this deck already. In love. That shuffle is amazing. The print, so thank you. Shout out to Printer Studio. I'll put a link to them down below so you guys can get your decks cracking. I think I spent like 60 bucks on this. Nice. I can dig it. Last one. Card number one. Very first draw. Ah, oh, son of a bitch! <laughs> Card number two. <laughs> Card number three. Yeah. I know, I know. I know. All right. I. <laughs> All right, I can dig it. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. I'm going to show this to my Facebook group. They're going to be so excited to see these. And um, I just cannot wait to have a lifelong love affair with this deck. Look at that spread. It just glides and shuffles so beautifully. All right, guys, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got to sit and contemplate on what I'm doing the most of because apparently I am doing the most. I bet it's the fucking fruit snacks. <laughs> Ever since quarantine popped off, I have been doing the most. Yeah, I need to get back on my sugar, my no sugar regimen before I get that sugar rage. Anyway, it's been fun. You guys have a wonderful day. And be mindful of your growth. Watch them grow, perceive devote. This is the seed, light the show. Watch them grow.